So I remember watching a video about Luigi's Mansion and Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon, and I was thinking, wouldn't it be cool if I actually made a video comparing the two games? Because I saw a lot of similarities and a lot of differences that could be seen, so I was thinking, why not just compare the two games and see which one would win with my the categories that I set it? So I did! Originally, this video was anticipated to be just a simple Thunder Compares. It wasn't going to be anything elaborate like I ended up having the, in the final product. It was just going to be a basic video, so I ended up scripting it, and I was just adding like little small details here and there. It was going to be like a short little video. As I gradually started to script it more and more, the script became around 3,000 words long, and I knew that this was not going to be something that was going to be easy and be able to pull off right off the bat. So I decided to spend a couple more weeks on scripting it, and it was around November or December of 2015 that I actually was scripting this video, because I remember I had that idea in mind around November, and it was around the time that my channel was in the process of moving into a different channel. So as scripting came by and I started to polish up the script, filming began around towards J January when I had anticipated to originally make it with my face. Meaning that you see this thunder on the screen? Yeah, that wasn't going to be part of the thunder compares. I originally wanted to put my face on there and I do have a first draft of it of when I where I actually do show my face, but unfortunately that got scrapped really quick and I decided to go with a much more simpler process which was just using the thunderbolt considering I had designed it at the time. What I also wanted to do is add a Rob the Robot characters because at the time I didn't have the Rob the Robot, like the actual thing. So what I decided to do is I decided to take a Google Images and or I decided to take an image from Google Images and I decided to use that as for uh, one of the recurring characters of the series like Thunder Compares and all that stuff and is now part of Thunder Compares and Thunder Reviews as you guys all know of as of right now. I also added another character who was my quote unquote son which only made a one time appearance which I do plan on bringing him back in some way shape or form but I don't think not at this point in time. However, filming process did not go as planned. You see, what happened is, around January through all the way through March, it was around towards the mid-January and then towards mid-March around there. It was at that time where I was not even working on Thunder Comparisons because at that point in time, I took a, a little hiatus from the making or the filming the Thunder Comparisons and I was like, when I came back to do it in March, I literally rushed myself making this video. I rushed myself with editing, I rushed myself with filming it, it was a complete mess. In fact, it came down to the point where some of the audio in the video is really bad. There are some times where you can't even hear me, there's some times where the music is too loud, there's some times where sometimes even the audio glitches, I'm pretty sure. So, it was a really bad start to the Thunder Comparison. So, I mean, honestly, while yes, it did have some complicated editing, it was not really the Thunder Comparison that I anticipated for it to be. I did even make a live stream about maybe a little bit of editing the video, but that's about it. There wasn't really too much. I was around halfway done with the video when I actually live streamed it because I remember that I did take a couple days with trying to pretty much edit as much possible and remember getting a Thunder Compares done in less than two weeks and editing it like basically I had to go from the whole filming process to finishing all the video in less than two weeks or around two weeks or so and I honestly think that that is one of the most torturing things I've ever done with the next with these thunder compares because I've never been able to I don't think at this current time I don't think I can do two thunder compares in or a thunder compares in the span of less than two weeks that was crazy the way I don't even know how I even was able to pull off that looking back at this thunder compares I think that this thunder compares is decent for the first video I mean yeah it wasn't my best thunder compares nor will it ever be my best thunder compares because I think that there's so many other thunder compares I have in mind that I want to make just as good and I want to be able to make them the best quality possible but enough talking I'm going to show you guys the first draft of the Luigi's Mansion versus Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon that I had made back in January so take a look at this Oh, no. 
no, not another mansion. I don't want to go back into that freaky scary mansion. I wish that stupid Mario was smart enough to not go into haunted mansions without some sort of warning. Oh great, not the same old thing again. We just saw this twice already. Uh, good thing it doesn't keep on going consecutively. Well then, there's only one thing to do. <sighs> I'm sorry to do this. Oh, that is much better than I expected. Now, I really enjoyed both Luigi's Mansion and Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon. But, you know, considering this is Thunder Comparison, well, you always know what question will always be asked a billion times, and that is, which of the two games do I like the best? Well, for me, I like to say that the old one is better than the new one. But in Thunder Compares, there's no accusing. In order for me to determine which game do I like the best, I will for these two games go through seven categories. And those seven categories are horror, ghosts, bosses, music, booze, challenges, and the final one, the best mansion. I am the Thunder Mario, and I'm gonna do my Luigi's Mansion versus Luigi's Mansion 2 comparison video! Now, these two games are meant to be horror, so it would make sense to rate the horror of these games. Now, I kind of have to give a point to the original game, because if you look deep into its beta, you can see that there are a lot of things planned that made it seem like you were playing a rated teens game. Like, imagine Freddy coming out of nowhere! Like, seriously, good thing find out that Freddy's wasn't even invented at the time. <laughs> oh my gosh, uh, I, I don't want to think about it. But in honesty, even without the beta included, they still made this game to a point where you could have gotten nightmares from this. Like, have you even seen the supposed game over footage that I guess was supposed to be part of when you, either you died or did not rescue Mario in time? I mean, let me show you that! Yeah... Imagine my son saw that like, seriously, he would be getting nightmares every day. Dad, I bet what you're about to show me isn't even scary at all. Uh, son, you should be a little bit more concerned. I mean, I mean, this could possibly give you nightmares. <laughs> yeah, right, I bet it's not even gonna give me nightmares. Like, seriously, I'm just gonna go watch it right now. Oh, well, son, whatever, just get scared, it's not like I'm gonna do anything. I'm gonna have nightmares for days! Yeah! Let's hope that's not my child in the future whenever he sees that clip. As in for Dark Moon, it tried to get back into the horror feeling, but didn't really seem to feel like you were getting jump scared as much as in this first one. I mean, you really don't have ghosts popping out of nowhere in this game as much as the first game. Dad! 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 What? What about the scene where King Boo comes out of nowhere on E2 in Luigi's Mansion Dark Moon? Well, I mean, that did kind of scare the balls out of me, but... Where did you come from? I, I haven't even, even got married, and nor did anyone even give birth to you. Oh, I don't know. I mean, I just got created. Well, yeah, so I'm gonna go now, alright? Then, so, bye-bye. Um, okay, bye future son, I guess. Jeez, where did these people keep coming from? Gosh, I wonder who will even give birth to him in the next, like, what, 20, 10 years? Yeah, let's go back to the review. But anyways, enough with all the crazy stuff that goes on like every two seconds. I got that the first Luigi Mansion wins this point.
I hope you guys enjoy this Thunder Compares behind the scenes sort of talk thing because I will be doing these more throughout the month of January. So I hope that you continue to watch these and yeah, that's really much it. So thank you guys all for watching and I'll see you guys all in the next video. Peace out guys and I like freaking!